Thursday, south winds to 30 knots, becoming southwest 20 to 25 knots with gusts to 45 knots. County, St. Clair, Michigan. The National Weather Service in Detroit, Pontiac, has issued a lakeshore flood warning, which is in effect from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. Thursday. Lakeshore flooding, strong southwest winds will allow water to pile into the north half of Lake St. Clair on Thursday. In addition, large waves of 2 to 3 feet are expected. The combination of higher water levels on the north side of the lake and large waves will result in water levels rising up above the flood stage of 55 inches. Recent water levels have averaged around 30 inches above chart datum by comparison. Impacts, water will be pushed inland and lead to lakeshore flooding along the shoreline of St. Clair County, including Harsons Island. A lakeshore flood warning means that flooding is occurring or imminent along the lake. Residents on or near the shore in the warned area should be alert for rising water and take appropriate action to protect life and property. Prepare, plan, and stay informed. Visit HTTP. Slash slash go dot USA dot gov slash RR8 along shore current is lake current that moves parallel to shore. Long shore currents can be strong enough to prevent swimmers from being able to keep their feet on the bottom, making it difficult to return to shore. To learn more about dangerous waves and currents, please visit dangerouscurrents.org all lowercase. counties in Michigan, Genesee, Lapeer, Lenaway, Livingston, Macomb, Monroe, Oakland, Shiawassee, St. Clair, Washington, and Wayne. High wind warning in effect from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. Thursday. The National Weather Service in Detroit, Pontiac, has issued high wind warning, which is in effect from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. Thursday. The high wind watch is no longer in effect. Hazardous weather, west wind gusts will reach 50 to 60 miles per hour Thursday morning through early Thursday evening. The most probable time periods for the strongest winds will be between 6 a.m. and 10 a.m., and then again between 3 p.m. and 9 p.m. Impacts, multiple hours of 50 to 60 miles per hour wind gusts could result in considerable tree and power line damage. Driving will become dangerous, especially for high-profile vehicles along north to south roadways. Some structural damage will be possible. A high wind warning means a hazardous high wind event is expected or occurring. Sustained wind speeds of at least 40 miles per hour or gusts of 58 miles per hour or more can lead to property damage. This storm has the potential to produce power outages. Alternative power sources generate bubbly carbon monoxide. Be safe. Always place generators, grills and other energy sources at least 20 feet from your home. Protect your family. Install a carbon monoxide detector. For more information go to HTTP slash slash www.cdc.gov slash co-prepare, plan, and stay informed. Visit http slash slash go.usa.gov slash r8. This is NOAA Weather Radio All Hazards, station KC63 in Southfield. This station broadcasts from the National Weather Service in White Lake at a frequency of 162.55 MHz. Here is the forecast for the northern suburbs.